Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode 5 of Sexy Brutale. Uh, well, <laughs> this uh, current look is uh, just a ski mask I have left over from when I was overseas. Uh, <laughs> driving around those Humvees can get pretty cold at night sometimes, but uh, yeah, it's kind of giving me a little difficulty talking to y'all, so uh, I'm going to have to lose it again, so if you give me just a minute, go ahead and get this thing off. <laughs> yeah, i got to start each episode like this in order to <laughs> keep up with what I was doing. Though, once again, I am running out of masks, because obviously I'm wearing a ski mask, and it's hot as... <laughs> well, it's just hot out here. So, not exactly the best uh, outfit to be wearing right now, but give me just a minute. Alright, I am back again. Yeah. <laughs> Though it was a lot more comfortable than some of those other masks I wore, and I actually had full visual. I know my voice probably wasn't that badly muffled, but uh, it's one of those things that would have annoyed me, thinking that my voice is, you know, like 10% lower or something. But yeah, let's get that mic out of the way real quick. All right, let's get back into it. It's been over a week since I played this last, so because uh, I just got back from vacation yesterday, so we'll see exactly how well I'm gonna do on this. I almost forgot it's actually a controller I need to be using, not my uh, mouse and keyboard. So let's get back to it. Who am I supposed to be right? Right. I just remembered. I fell down through um, that glass window. That the singer that we just rescued uh, broke. So, er, why is it not closing out? I pressed the button. Why do you not work? Come on, game. Respond, darn it! There we go. All right. Yeah, I probably had to cut that part out, too, uh, simply because of the fact that the game controller wasn't responding for just a minute. But, uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> this is probably my introduction from that point, since that other part got messed up. Uh, yes, we ended the last episode with us falling down through a window that we busted out uh, with the singing lady's voice. And now we are trying to figure out who we're going to say. Let's see if we actually No, not that one. Okay, so we're looking for a double, this group right here. So we're trying to save two people again, like we did with the uh, blind lady and the luchador-looking dude. So, let's get to it. Get up, soldier. No time to be sitting down. Is that a... That, that's a martini vending machine. <laughs> oh, that's nice. No, I don't want advanced time. Alright. <laughs> hmm. Want emergency power now. Wait a minute. Lightfingered locksmith and the gentle Goliath. I'm guessing we're probably going to get the locksmith skill here from this group. The gentle giant and the locksmith. Come on, open the door, darn it. Let's look around here real quick. I did have to cut the other episodes down pretty heavily, so we'll see how uh, much I'll have to cut this one. Good grief, look at all those swords. I know I saw those upstairs in the last episode, but... I bet you this is how the locksmith dies. I bet you he goes in there to maybe break in and steal something and ends up getting killed. Yes, let's start by scouting around, see if we can find anything interesting. Like this. Power's still off. Wait, what's that on the ground? Whoopsie doodle. Okay, that's clearly the locksmith, because he has a giant lock on the back of his, uh, kind of Greek-looking, or not Greek, uh... Maybe it's Greek. I was thinking maybe Greek or Persian. 
That is an owl lady. Look at that picture right there on the wall. That's an owl lady. Whoopsie. Time to go. Sweet mother of pearls! I take it this is the egg? Yeah, that guy is huge. Hmm. That crazy rich bastard. Wait. Grayson, wait. Something's not right. A large set of sh uh, swords. And there goes the gunshot again. Before you get the awful death cage, I like that. Fine. You check that way, I'll check I'll take the room. Let's make sure this all goes off or disconnected. <laughs> uh, you know it. I bet I have to save him first so he can save the other guy. Although I just want to see. Yeah, he's totally gonna get trapped in there. Can't hurt just to take a look. I mean, I took a look. Oh, sweet lord! It is! Look at it! Wait. Hey, my hands! What is this? Ugh. Did you touch glue? Read! Well, what did you learn? What? Ooh! I don't know, I didn't see! Ladies and the show will start in one hour. <laughs> well, when dealing with Tesla coils and glue... Oh no. <laughs> I don't like this officially not having fun. Read We're actually gonna have to watch him die, obviously. <laughs> but great, there's a trap door. Obviously, it's moving too fast for me to read it to you guys, but. Oh, here comes the swords. The spikes of death descend. The spikes of what? <laughs> well, obviously we got a little time. That's going to be probably what kills him. Because his indicator shows he dies first. I have my hands! I need my hands! Yeah, Reed's about to go. I wonder if I should step out of here and see if I can see what happens to him. 
Nope. I was hoping I could step out and get to that door and look through it, but... Now I just look like a psychopath sitting here watching. Oh, he's gonna grab the cage, isn't he? Yuri, don't! Yeah, he fried. Talk to me, please! I'm sorry! Well, you're not obviously dead yet. Hey, Mr. Ghosty, you want to talk? Exactly as he should be, skewered on swords. Not what I meant, darn it. Ah, his mask burned off. <laughs> Flop. <laughs> well, we now know what happens to them. The question is, how can we save them? So, first things first, we're going to ignore that way and try to light this candle. I keep hitting that button, but it won't work. I think it's I don't have a candle, so I'm not sure how I'm supposed to light that other candle. So let's. Ooh, there's a playing card. There was something about the mirrors in that other room that I think a guy went through. Well, I guess unless I see him do it, I won't know how to do it myself. This should lead me back into the other room. Let's get back to the map, please. Okay, yeah, it goes back in the hallway. Open the door, please. There we go. Eight of diamonds. Let's see if there's anything interesting to read here. Obviously, you want to read these, just hit the pause button because I really don't want to waste everybody's time reading these myself. Wait a minute. Okay, maybe you gotta pull the switches at the same time. Okay, I'm going up there, behind the stage. Five of clubs. That was awfully close. What is this? 
Okay, I thought it was the item on the ground, not the actual clothing rack. Let's see. Like, there's only two rooms left I haven't been to yet. Hmm. Alright, we'll go ahead and check the rest of these. Wait, what's this? Ah, okay. I found a golden lighter. Nice. Anything else in here? Like I said before, I needed a lighter. Start lighting those candles. Aha! The King of Hearts! With his hand of mine glows with an awesome power! Alright. I'm gonna get in position. I'm gonna try and pull the lever at the same time the other guy does. I bet you that's what I have to do, so. Where was that candle I said I needed a light? Because I got a lighter now. I still got a few minutes before it starts, so. Where was that candle? Is it on the map? Yeah, it's actually in the larger room where everybody else is. Well, I should have saw that, and I didn't. Sorry. <laughs> Did it say the candle was in here? No, actually, it's the room beneath this. There it is, Dag Nabbit. So, where is this? Oh, there he is. Ah, you there, Lackey! Will you go and tell those bloody idiots to turn the power back on? They, they've been buggering about with the electrics that's sold in the basement. Tell them there's a circuit breaker behind the bookshelf on the Northeast Library right here. Lucas, bless him, had the whole place secretly wild up for the big magician show. He was such a fan of this disappearing acts. Great love for drama, you know. Anyway, shut up. You're boring me. <laughs> okay, so where is this secret panel? Hidden circuit board. Okay. Hmm. Okay. While you're going that way, I'm going to go this way and try to flip it myself. I didn't. Ah! Why would you do that? Why? Okay, now everything's back on. Let's flip these switches. Okay, let's see if I can get here and look out in time. A spike of death descend again! I didn't mean that. Yeah, it will now that I'm here on the other side. Okay, 
Let's start pulling it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Did it work? You did it! Gray, are you okay? Oh my god! It stopped! At least you're talking slower enough now. Well, this was an easier one to do than the other two. Reed, what are you doing? The door's shut! Bloody hell. I forget what the total brute you are. Get those damn things off you. There. God, that's better. Ha 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 ha! Just stretch his stuff. He's got a marvelous beard, you know. Look at that guy's jawline. Good grief. He's both manly and powerful. The other one looks more like a dwarf. Laffy, old boy! I was in a bad way back there. Did you do something, Lafidio? I don't know. Did you help me? Thank you! Come on, Red! The bar's calling! You'll be like that guy down there on the middle. If y'all see my videos, you know I stroke my beard a lot anyway. Yeah, that other guy's got a chin that can cut uh, glass. This guy's got a chin that is uh, like a buffing wheel. <laughs> That's quite enough drama for one day. Yep, we got the lockpicking helmet. Bye, guys! An electric performance. You're back, my, uh, Titan Queen. Kinda... Like a skinned one. Boon! Or, Boon. He was here, wasn't he? Then why? Hey, look, I found a helmet. I'm gonna put it on now. You didn't have to ask me. Oh my god, it's on my face! Ah, the sounds! Sounds like crackling bones. Grayson's light finger touch. A professional thief turned security expert, Grayson is unparalleled locksmith. Grayson mask allows you to crack physical locks within the mansion. Open padlocks and safes by using the power when the prompt appears. Grayson was very, very talented safe cracker. He used his gifts to create many of the systems in the mansion. You will not find any locks that can be kept, or that can keep their secrets from you now. Not many, but some. You have to go. Everything's exploding! Why? Did I get to keep the lighter too, or? Guess we'll find out in a minute. Saturday. I did keep the lighter, sweet. Well, we got a little time left, so I'm actually going to run around and try to open some of these safes and light some of these candles now that I have both. Ah, I was using the wrong button. Finally could find out what's in these things. Of course. Nothing but Chuck Testa. Hmm. What is in here, anyway? Oh, it's this room. Wait a minute. So who am I out? I'm out to save these two now. But, how do I get to the next area? Body, I'm uh, going to go ahead and leave this episode here because clearly I didn't actually find the actual exit. It's actually more challenging to find the exit than it was to finish the mission. But, uh, by the time the next episode comes out, I'll figure it out and we'll already be out of this uh 
predicament. So until then, everybody, take care, be safe out there, and I will see you next time. Oh, if you haven't done so already, hit that like and subscribe for future content. And uh, leave a comment if you feel like it. So until then, everybody, take care.